Hello, so this is my three months on testosterone today, January 18th. I started tea on, obviously, on October 18th, and so I just want to make this video because I didn't make it for the past two months because, you know, I'm good at, you know, keeping up with what I want to say and, like, trying to keep track of this stuff. You know, it's just for me because I have zero subscribers, so who cares? No one even watches this except for me, like, in the future. But I didn't make it for the past two months, so I'm doing it now because it's three months and I've, I've noticed some changes that I didn't really notice before um, so I'm gonna get started on this. So recently like voice comparison I'm not gonna do you know the fancy side by side this is my voice and blah 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 comparison because I don't <laughs> I don't know how to do that but um, I have started to notice recently my voice cracking more and it also kind of being lower like in the shower I can sing lower on my own and I feel like I can talk lower on my own normally rather than just forcing it. I've had less sore throat from like trying to force it so I feel like that's something that has changed that's different. Um, otherwise what is known as Shark Week hasn't yet stopped for me. I had it the past like the first two months which was really upsetting and like the worst thing because like I thought oh you know I can start it and it'll stop right away but no it didn't. It hasn't and I hope it doesn't happen again at the beginning of like now going into my my fourth month I hope that will stop. Um, otherwise, I've noticed I've been a lot hungrier since I started. Like, my hunger was a lot. Like, I used to go periods of time where, you know, I could just not eat for a while. I could just, you know, be without eating. But no, since then, I could, I'm always down. I'm always ready to eat anything. So that's just more evidence of me being, you know, a just starting puberty 14-year-old boy since I would eat anything all the time. And I'm always, like, kind of hungry. Like, not, like, actively, like, oh, I'm starving, but just, like, you know, I could eat something right now. So I've been trying to, like, be conscious of that so I don't gain a bunch of weight. I have noticed a little bit that, like, I might be getting muscle more quickly because, like, I haven't lost any muscle since I haven't been working out since I started tea, which is dumb of me. I'm stupid. I should be working out, but I haven't. I'm too lazy. And I don't go to the gym with my friend anymore. And so I'm dumb. But I've noticed that I haven't really lost any of my muscle stuff. And when I do do push-ups, it's not that hard, which I have been trying to do to make up for not going to work out. Just doing push-ups every day. But I only kind of do it. It's not very consistent. But I have noticed that I haven't really been losing, like, you know, the definition that I had. The little bit I had, like, in my arms or my shoulders and stuff, which is good. Um... Otherwise, you know, the down there region has been changing. Um, I haven't really noticed anything else. Luckily, my hair isn't falling out, and I'm not, you know, a crazy anger or unmanageable person. I don't know, which is what some people were telling me would happen, which I know wasn't true. Um, other than that, just recently I started talking to my mom about getting top surgery, like within this week. I've been trying to bring it up and trying to see how she feels about it so I can, you know, warm her up to the idea because that's really my next step. We also have started trying to get starting to get my name changed legally and we started talking to this local like pro bono lawyer who works with like the Mount Sinai clinic that I've been going to to get my tea prescription um, to try and do that as quickly as possible hopefully before I go to college that would be really nice also would love to get top surgery for, before I go to college but I'm not sure how that would work out so I've been going through all that stuff trying to get that all sorted out for myself so that you know I can get through these biggest three parts that I feel like the biggest three parts of my transition so I can just start to live my life you know and be happy and be comfortable and you know do all that stuff so hopefully I will make more of these update videos as I go on with this stuff because that's what I do want to do but I probably won't do them that frequently and no one sees them anyway so no one cares I care me in the future cares that I'm not making them frequently but I haven't really noticed anything that different I'm sure if when I go back after this and watch the one month after seeing how my voice sounds in this room, I'm like, holy shit, it's so different. But right now I can't really tell, and no one else can really tell, except for, you know, the obnoxious voice cracks. But that's all for now. Now, back to talking my phone in the window soon. Okay.